Color Photo Stitch produces variegated stitching with multiple thread colors. The overall effect is like multicolored stippling. Use the feature to create embroidery from photographs and other images. This video looks at techniques for doing so. Prepare the photo. For best results, use crisp images with well-defined subjects and constantly varying shades. Select the image and size it to approximate target dimensions. Choose a cropping option and drag the marquee around the area to be cropped. Using the reshape tool, adjust marquee size with the triangular sizing handles. Here we've set it to around 100 by 80 millimeters. Adjust the position of the marquee by dragging the pink diamond control point. Press ESC to complete. Convert the photo to embroidery. With the image selected, click Color Photo Stitch. Click the Adjust button for further options. In this case, we've set lightness to 0.85 and contrast to 20. Set the number of thread colors. There is a point of diminishing returns where more colors do not always result in greater design clarity or stitchability. Use the color matching method to assign image colors to the color palette for manual thread matching. Choose to add thread chart colors to the design palette. Here we're using Isochord 40. Fine tune your design. Notice that some areas have been assigned unexpected colors. Select the affected stitches and change to a more suitable color. Delete unwanted stitches or even needle points with the reshape tool. Add a border. Select all color blocks in the design and group them. Go to the toolbox and select Outlines and Offsets. Tick both checkboxes and set as shown. Select both Satin Outline and Motif Run Objects. Go to the Edit menu and choose Smooth Curves. This value controls how closely the smoothed outline follows the original. Here we use a precision of 1.5 mm. Select the Motif Run Object and change motifs, for instance Star 16, and adjust the spacing, in this case 15 mm. Add the lettering. Now we're going to add some lettering. With the lettering tool, key in the number 2. Choose an outline font such as Swiss Run Hollow and set the height, in this case 30 millimeters. Choose a blue thread from the color palette and type the words Happy Birthday. Here we use 3D monoglyceride font with a height of 10 mm and an arc counterclockwise baseline. Use the motif run as a guide when creating the arc. Enter the words 10th June 2018. Here we set the font to Handyscript at a height of 10 mm. Select all the lettering and motif run objects and choose a line tool. Remove the overlap. Select the motif object, go to Edit Tools and choose the knife tool. Cut the overlapped area as shown. Delete the overlapped object. Adjust the motif with the reshape tool as preferred.
Finalize the design. For a better view of the design palette, click Remove Unused Colors. Assign a thread to the green color. Choose your preferred thread, for example, 5730. Drag and drop color blocks to resequence. Preview the stitch out by running the stitch player and watching the simulation. 